years ago it became obvious to me that that the world is beautiful because of diversity I mean it's amazing you know it's all this beautiful diversity and people are missing it they're not seeing it you know and 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 when I looked at the notion of a divine presence of, of a divine mind I I realized that God is a God of diversity you know God is diverse that's why different cultures and different peoples understand God in different ways so we can have a sense of how amazing and beautiful and infinite God can be you know because we can see different faces different ways of understanding something that is to us inconceivable I mean we can't understand God because God is so big I mean we, we look at pictures of the Hubble that t took of galaxies you know thousands of galaxies in just a little tiny space thousands of galaxies and and then we worry about whether what God looks like you know how, how does that work why do we do that I mean God is beautiful God is diverse and infinite the universe is a reflection of God so so it occurred to us that the way to understand God is to celebrate diversity and celebrate the many faces of God and the many ways that God speaks to us and shares with us and and reflects God presence or divine presence into the world so and and there are many people who over time over generations and centuries and eons have 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 um, brought divine presence into the world and 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 divine understanding but and they're all reflections of one mind one divine presence and when we start to understand that then we start to understand that we are all one people that we aren't you know from this country and that country and this race and that race and this orientation and that orientation that we are by nature all connected because we are all spirit by nature connected to divine presence connected to divine mind connected to each other because we are infinite and so once we start to understand that and once we start to understand that there is no one way or right way in a world of diversity beautiful diversity there can't be because the universe is amazingly rich and enriching because of its differences so we become enriched by understanding that and looking at that and also we become enriched by looking at a God with many faces and understanding that this God with many faces is only a small reflection of what a divine mind truly is so and we can we understand it not at all not a chance you know um, am I am I uh, um, going to try and explain to people what God is or what divine mind is never can't do it not possible but I can start to try and understand it by understanding that the universe is bigger than I can imagine <laughs> you know and therefore God is bigger than I can imagine and that there's no point in us fighting and arguing about you know the minutia of what God is because God is all those things and we're all connected and we are one family one people one mind really although we don't act it all the time so I'm lucky I'm lucky because I've been able over the years to work with spirit and to grow through spirit and to become aware of uh, that presence that's there um, in a way that's meaningful and purposeful I mean if I just talked to spirit and didn't mean anything to anybody I'd be a crazy person <laughs> wouldn't make any sense do, do you know so but fortunately thank God I'm not a crazy person <laughs> <laughs> Thank God it makes some sense out there in the world, you know, when I'm working with spirit. And and thank God it's concrete for me, you know. I'm pretty grounded, you know, I'm not uh I I'm I work very hard not to be space cadet. <laughs> you know, because being space cadet isn't very useful. <laughs>
to know. What's useful is being um, grounded and uh, choosing to be of service in a meaningful, purposeful way and to love people and to love um, empowering people to become all they can be.